Hey, how are you guys doing out there? Andy here from the Bitter Fleet channel, showing you my rig RC four wheel drives Trail Finder 2. I'm actually replacing our floor right now. Excuse the mess. I just took a break and uh, I want to show you something I'm excited about this TF2. So what is this exciting news I'm talking about? Well, I'm finally able to tuck my front tires into the wheel well of this Trail Finder 2. To say this nicely, the front flex of the Trail Finder 2 is not the best out there. But now I'm able to do this. Right there, it just tucks the tire in the wheel well. And I'm pretty happy about that. Because before, when the truck flexes, the tire doesn't even get close inside the wheel well. And that really bothers me. As you can see here, I run my leaf springs under the axles. I have flipped my axles a couple times, so I don't know how it comes stock. But as you can see here in my truck, my shock mounts are facing down. It also helps with the lower profile that I am trying to achieve. I also have the Chino mod on all my leaf springs, and I'm also running the O-ring mod as well. I am just trying to get as much flex as possible from this leaf sprung truck. And trust me, it's not that easy, unless you want to go fully linked. I have a boom racing wheel and tire combo with the classic Steelys paired with the Mud Terrain Trophy tires. If I remember it right, these are 1.9s. I kind of like the narrow profile because it doesn't stick out as much from the truck. For more scale goodness, I have the Old Man Emu shocks from RC Four Wheel Drive. I believe these are 70 millimeters. I wanted this rig to look like a stock truck or maybe a truck that has a two or three inch lift. And so far, I'm pretty happy with what I got. got kick. On here, I demonstrate the maximum front flex without lifting any of the other tires. Let me show you some of the other angles around here. Look at that rear tuck as well, I just love to see that. And on this instance, I'm showing you the rear tire flex without lifting any of the three other tires. And check that out, that front tuck right there. I'm excited to see this kind of flex on my future films. I can't wait to take this out on the trail. Now at the time of this video, before I made this mod, I already shot about three or four videos that I'm still currently working on and we'll be releasing it here in a couple of weeks. Unfortunately, this kind of flex won't be shown on those videos, so I apologize. And I'm hoping you stay tuned. Please like this video, watch my other videos and like them and help me grow this channel by subscribing and see you on the next one. Peace. I'm gonna take it for a ride, let me